morning, everyone. How you guys doing today? This is Justin Booth coming at you with a different type of YouTube video. Sitting here in my backyard, chilling with my plants, the birds, and just taking up and, and all the energy today. Um, this video is a serious video. Um, I've, after careful discussion with many different people, some who wish to re be, uh, wish to remain unnamed and some of them wish uh, or say that it's all right that we do use their names. Um, a lot of people told me not to do this video because there's so much intensity with uh, drug companies and FDA and powers and higher powers or corporate powers and industrial powers and such. And um, over the last six months, I have seen what normal people would call miracles because uh, when dealing with certain types of diseases or cancers or life-threatening illnesses that they claim that there's no cures for, um, I've seen these things disappear. And we are going to be providing testimonials, okay? I'm not saying that these things are the cure that's going to happen. Every time you do these things, it's going to cure you. No, it's not. It's not. It's not, uh, it's not what I'm, I'm coming here to tell you. What I'm, I'm coming here to, to, to share with you is the stories that I've seen in the past six months and been able to share with the people that I'm working with in order to heal the human body and the human condition with no pharmaceutical drugs whatsoever. A very, very clean, balanced diet. An introduction of energy work, different type of energy works depending on what type of person you are, and a different uh, all around just being. Now, um, there are certain stories that I'm going to be sharing with you guys bit by bit as we go along in the coming months here, and uh, you know, just to give you a little taste of what I'm discussing, uh, one of the ladies that I work with very closely, uh, she has done some amazing work. Uh, there was a, a lady that she was working with who had two, term, two tumors uh, next to, I think it was the gall, gallbladder and, um, and the uterus. And they went in, uh, did an MRI. There was pictures of this. The doctor still had the pictures of it. They, she took them home. You see these two cancers there. And, you know, she, they wanted to do surgery. They couldn't really do surgery because it, it was too tough of a tumor to get in there. And, you know, they said, we need to do chemotherapy immediately. We need to do this. You've you got to do this or you're going to die, they said to her. The doctor said this. If you do not do this, you are going to die. That's pretty harsh. Imagine someone saying that to you. Imagine saying that, someone saying that to your mom or your dad or your, your brother, sister, aunt, uncle, someone you care about, maybe boss. It doesn't matter. It always make, makes you want to cry. Maybe there's some people watching this right now that this has already happened. So you, you know what I'm talking about. Well, and this there's more than ca cases than just this one incident, but this lady came to, um, uh, this lady with the, the cancer came to the lady I work with, and they started doing Bowen treatment, which is a energy treatment with hands. Uh, Reiki, it's like a Reiki energy. And again, I can get more into detail about this into uh, different videos. I'm just trying to share the story for now. After three weeks of energy healings and a strict diet of absolutely removing all protein, meat protein, from the diet, and no wheat and no grain, she put this lady on a strict raw food diet, all raw food and heavy on different types of juices like barley grass, wheat grass, green base juices, live juices, live enzymes. They go right into the bloodstream. Within three weeks, this lady went back to the doctors. They did the MRI. They said, oh, there must be some, we must have made some sort of mistake. It's gone. The tumors disappeared into the body. Just without surgery, without anything, they disappeared. They absorbed into the body. And the doctors told her, no, we, we must have made some mistake. And she said, no, I, I went to see this natural path. And she put me on this diet because my friend, a referral, had this so, sort of same thing, but a different uh, type of ailment. 
disappeared. That she should say, no, 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 no. There's the MRIs that you took from three weeks ago. There are the spots. The doctor's like, well, no, we must have made some mistake. The doctors would not be proved wrong that these tumors were there, the malignant tumors were there three weeks ago, and they were not there three weeks later because of positive affirmations, energy healing, in a specific diet, removing all meat proteins from the body, wheat and grains, and introducing a high alkaline based diet to, to draw the acid back out of the body because when, I don't know the numbers, but I would say a high amount of people, if they have cancer, rheumatoid arthritis, if they have diabetes, all these different things, and I, I'm, you know, I'm going to do some research on this so I can bring the numbers to you because I, I already know, I can feel it, the acid is too high in the body, it's, it's about the diets that we eat here in North America, they don't have the same types of cancers that they're getting you know, in the east than we are here, and it's because of what we're doing, and it, and it goes even deeper to that, I mean if you think back Back in the day, silver has great healing properties, right? And that's why in, you know, old days, when you eat, you eat with silverware. Because as you eat with the silver, it's going through the silver uh, met metals that are going through your body. It's helping to clean your body. Now we say, oh, no, it's cheaper and better to use stainless steel. And we're using these stainless steel tools to eat that are not healing based, they do not have healing properties, it's not a healing metal. And these are metals that are going into our body and are poisoning us. We have to be open and understand that this is not BS that's coming through my mouth. It's, it, it, if you take a step back, you don't need a high school education to look at this stuff. You can just see the numbers. You can see the information and you can see how we've changed as a society to uh, you know, we're, we're looking for we're qu uh, quantity rather than quality, and that has really, really affected us in a spiritual level and uh, in a material level because it's, it's, really, it's really taken a toll on us. Either way, I'm going to have, as I said, more information about these stories. I have to gather more, and I'm going to be doing this for the rest of my life because, uh, you know, people have said to me, Oh, aren't you worried about the uh, FDA going to sue you or something like that? Well, you know what? I'm, I don't have any money, so I don't know how they can sue me for anything. And someone needs to start speaking up. And there is people like me speaking up to these things, uh, to these issues, to these corporate powers, to these doctors that do not recognize or want to recognize the fact that there's natural healing properties available for us right below our feet. If you want more information about this, please check out wheatgrassorganics.com, soulfoodfarming.org, and we are doing what we can to create a better future for all. At all times, we are different organizations coming together to create a better future. We want to create an abundant future, a place where people eat and live for free so that we can learn at whatever we want to better ourselves as a community, as a culture. We also want to provide a retreat so that people can come and get out of this program that we've been sucked into without even realizing it through the media, mainstream media, through the newspapers, you know, all these type of, you know, subliminal messages that come through the different types of music that we listen to. I, 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 like, maybe some of my friends that are watching this would be like, you're such a hypocrite, Justin. But you know what? I'm not because... It, I'm out of that now, and, and once I've, it's, it's an amazing, once you just have that small shift that changes your perception on what really matters and what makes you feel whole. I mean, not good as a need or like money, like that, that feeling, oh, if I have money, I can buy anything. Well, there's, there's actually a huge, huge better feeling that you can harness inside your body and you can actually give this to other people 
you don't even have to touch them. You can send these energies to people through thought, through writing, through intentions. But people don't believe it. They think it's too far-fetched. Well, I'm here to start to share these stories with you so that you can understand that these are real stories. And if you want to connect with us, you know, we would love to hear your stories. If you have what you would say miracle stories, and these are not miracles, please understand. It's very important. This is not a miracle story. These are not miracle stories. These are natural things that the body, the human body does, but we just don't understand that it does it. You know, we don't understand how amazing our bodies are. But once we start to tap into the sacred, you know, DNA and consciousness of what we all really are, it's amazing. So, this is Justin Booth, sending you love, light, and passion to you, your friends, your family, and all that you connect with. And don't forget to little strangers. Namaste.